So you said I can get a tattoo with you? Yeah, sure. Tell me what you're gonna get. I have no idea what I'm gonna get, like seriously. What do you yeah, think? I'll get this exact logo on my chest right here. Would you really? Yeah, and then I can just show up to work without a shirt on. I'll give you 20% off if you get Onassis logoed on you. Yeah, my parents would not like that. You girls have fun at the birthday party. Here's Ava's water. She had yogurt only. Don't okay. feed her bacon. Okay. A little bacon? No bacon. You can give her eggs and toast though. Last breakfast of the day. That robot you hear is Emma playing with. What's the name of this robot? Me Miko. Miko. Hi. She's playing with Miko. My last brunch, breakfast of the year, 2022, is a delicious bacon, egg, pepper jack cheese sandwich. Very excited about this. Yeah, we got, we got a thing to pitch up for mommy. So when she comes home, it's nice and clean. I wanted to take a second and reflect on what this past year has meant to me. Be patient with the, the extra noises I have in the background. I am babysitting right now. Do you call it babysitting if it's your own kids? Uh, I'm watching my children right now while my, my wife and the two older girls are out on a play date. For me, it kind of has ended right where it started and that was with daily vlogging and, and with all of you. And it's so great to be back, you have no idea but this year has, has been beautiful. I've never been in, the, in a better shape in my entire life. I got to do Ironman Florida, and I did put vlogging on the back burner, and I even put the businesses on the back burner, actually for the first time in my life, obviously still inside the businesses, but not like in the businesses, and not, not hanging out with you guys, which y'all take up a lot of my time, uh, to be frank. By being able to step away, it just made me want to come back and come back harder and stronger and more frivolous and just get in there and, and start grinding and working. And, and that's what we've been doing with the vlogs and then just getting in the restaurants day in and day out and, and just really making everything so fantastic. So you really do inspire me and, and motivate me to, to keep doing all those things. and. That's what we're gonna do in 23. We're gonna get back in these restaurants. We're gonna stay in these restaurants. We're gonna make these restaurants fantastic. We're gonna increase sales. We're gonna increase guest retention. We're gonna grow guest retention. We're gonna grow guest numbers. We're gonna do all the things that a great restaurant owner would do. And you're gonna be along for the journey. And I'm gonna keep you along for the journey even longer this time. I, I'm planning on not falling off. And, and even if I do slow down, uh, it's just gonna be Fun a slight tonight. slowdown and not a shutdown like we did last year. I hope you're ready for it. Let's get inside Onassis Greek Tap House and Kitchen. Let's have some fun tonight. Happy New Year, man. Happy New Year, dude. What you got planned? Just hanging out with you tonight. Oh, man. Ready to make some money? Beautiful thing, yes sir. Always. This is Buick's last shift. So everybody, thank you for all your hard work, Buick. A year and a half of hard work. The last shift of the last year of having Buick here. She's always welcome here. She's done tremendous things for the restaurant, but the, the business like ran flawlessly. And I think you were a big, a big part of that. Uh, and yeah, I mean, you, you have continued to be a big part of that up to the last second of you being clocked in. To find an employee like you is like a diamond in the rough. So thank you. No, seriously, I, I really do appreciate all your hard work. And I think it goes, you know, unsaid with everybody else that's worked with you. Thank you, Buick, for real. Thank you for all your hard work and, and thanks for all the, all, all the things you've done for our business. Sometimes it feels like I'm losing my influence But I don't care Today I sit back and run with the clouds And no, it ain't better some This is our first slowest day of the entire week. It's been non-stop go, 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 but New Year's Eve, it didn't pop like the other days. So the business side of, of running the business, not the vlog side, is cutting labor down because 
when you're not making money and you're spending money, the ship is like sinking essentially. So I'm gonna go back there. I'm sure it will be easy to let some of these kids go home early tonight so that way they can get ready for what I assume they have plans for New Year's Eve. Tristan, let me ask Tristan, if he doesn't wanna go home, then it's gonna be Brett. Tristan, how did you do today, bud? I did all right, man. You know, I got a lot of cash tips today. Right there, I saw you. All oh, right. Bye. To the end of a chapter. The beginning of another. <laughs> it was great uh, working with you. You too. Stay sturdy, stay cool, keep your head up, stay in school. Happy New Year, Dagan. Happy New Year. The saddest part about tonight is we lost our head server, Buick. She was, uh, man, she really held this place up on her shoulders, and I don't know what it's going to be like without her. I'm definitely going to have to step in and help out but she got married and uh, she's moving on to the next chapter of her life that's probably one of the saddest parts of this business is we get so many fantastic people who are transitioning through their lives and going on to doing bigger and better things uh anyway just really sad about that but 2022 man <sighs> Just gotta reflect on it, you know? And hope for the best for 2023. Have a great night, happy new years, and we will see you tomorrow.